Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Back, back, back. I shouldn't really say welcome back because that means that I've been here and you've been missing when that's simply not been the case. I've also been gone. I stopped making videos, don't really know why, don't really know why I came back, just felt like it was right. Um, yeah, so today I'm just gonna vlog my day. It's a Monday, technically like my Sunday. I don't work Sunday, Monday usually. Um, so I had yesterday off, but I did absolutely nothing. So today I have errands to run, people to see, things to do. It's gonna be a little bit of a transition. As you can see, I'm starting off the day looking fabulous jokes. Um, I'm getting ready to go to the gym. I, uh, I hate going to the gym. I have this theory and I don't want this to come off the wrong way because this is a theory about myself and I don't want the gym rats to come for me, but I only ever like go to the gym and get in good shape when I'm depressed. <laughs> like when I'm happy, I'm like, oh, I have so many other things I want to do. I love myself. I don't want to go to the gym. And then I start feeling like crap and then I go to the gym. So I haven't been going to the gym lately, which is good news for my mental state, but I don't actually feel depressed right now. So this is why I'm afraid the gym is not gonna be the best route for me. But for various reasons that will be talked about later, I just kind of want to get back in shape. So I'm going on a hot girl walk. It's actually a little bit more than a hot girl walk. It's um, the 12, 3, 30. I did this a while ago and I actually really like it because part of the reason I hate going to the gym is just like trying to figure out what to do and yeah and then I just am like oh the machine's busy I guess I gotta go home or whatever um but this is simple you just go on the treadmill for 30 minutes at incline 12 speed 3 I think is what it is or yeah and it's just nice because you get on there it's actually like a pretty really good workout and people get really great results from it and like I can feel it even after like day one and day two so that's what I'm going to do um and then I'm going to come back shower I have a nail appointment. I'm going over to my friend's house. I'm selling my computer today to somebody random meeting in a parking lot. I might go with Paige to a children's sporting event. I need to do laundry. I need a fake tan. That's why I said it's gonna be a little bit of a transition because I'm going from looking my absolute best. Just kidding. Um, but I am really excited to get my nails done. I took my nails off because I'm trying to save money. Same reason I'm trying to look good, trying to save money. Big things coming. Um, but it's just simply, this just can't happen. They're black and I pick them off way too much. I just pick up my nails. I'm gonna get my acrylic nails back on. I'm gonna do French tips. I'm very excited about it. I'm very much out of breath. But first things first, I need to go to my gym. I tried to go to my gym yesterday. The code wasn't working. There was a group of men on the other side of the door and I felt very flustered that my code wasn't working like I was trying to break in. They did not try to open the door for me, so fuck me then. So I'm going to go today with confidence. I think the apartment building is open. Like, so if my code's not working, I can ask them maybe for help. The women in there are also kind of mean. So here's to hoping I don't get bullied. If there's nobody in the gym, I'll vlog there. I shouldn't really say gym because it's tiny. It has like three equipment machines. Okay. Bye for now. I'm back. I did go to the gym. A lot of time has passed. Um, my code worked on the first time, which was great, but I ultimately did not vlog in there. There was a man working out, just like classic man working out vibes, acting like he was the only one in there, rapping out loud to his music, um, screw, like, ah, uh, when he was lifting, like hyping himself up, which is like, I get it, but at the same time, just be a little courteous. <laughs> And so I was like, yeah, no, this is not going to happen. The workout was great. Um, it felt really good. I finished the whole thing through, which sometimes when I like start that up for the first time, I have to like lower the incline or do something like that. Um, I did take a break at like 10 minutes, 20 minutes, and then obviously I was done at 30. So that helped a little bit, but even so it was like just like a five, not five, maybe like 15 second break to like take a drink of water. Um, so overall I felt really great about it. Came home. Um, was like so sweaty, like literally peeled my leggings off my body, got in the shower. I was kind of on the fence whether or not I should fake tan like right out of the shower or just wait and FaceTime later, or fake, fake tan later. Um, as I like right before I go to bed, but ultimately I was like, let's just do it right now. 
which then led me laying on the floor <laughs> waiting for my fake tan to dry for what seems like forever and so I waited honestly a little too long and I'm kind of rushed um I did my makeup I blue dry my hair like partly and now I'm gonna put it up in a claw clip which as trendy as it is anyone who thinks says they're uncomfortable is just like lying to themselves especially when you're driving but luckily I'm not driving that far um so that's what I was doing just like straightening the front pieces of my hair um yeah and then so not only was I like already kind of in a time crunch well then my nail lady called and she was like can you come early and I was like sure I'll, I'll do my best I think I'm only gonna be able to get there like 15 minutes early so not even too oh fuck I need to take my nail polish off <clears throat> I don't know, does anybody else feel that way? Like you can't go to the nail salon with nail polish on, especially since like they didn't do this and it just kind of looks bad. Okay, does that look good? Ooh, it doesn't really look good in there, but it looks good in my mirror. Then I'm gonna wear my sunglasses anyways, which, okay. So I am fake tanned. Currently, a couple things knocked off my checklist. I need to take off my nail polish. Real quick before I left, I took off my nail polish. I wanted to do fit check. These are Levi's shorts. If you haven't bought Levi's shorts from Fred Meyer, you're honestly missing out. These are my Adidas size. I got them from Amazon. These are also from Amazon. This shirt, I think, was from Target. And I cropped it. I got a load of my computer first. You can kind of see it right there. Because after my nail appointment, I hang out with my friend. I'm meeting up with the girl so she can buy it. Okay, so it's currently 12.53. My original appointment was at one and she said, can you come in here earlier? And I said, maybe 12.45. I've missed 12.45, I'm very thirsty and I always drink a lot of water and I don't really have a lot, or I drink a lot of water when I'm sitting getting my nails done. Don't really have enough my water bottle. I feel like since I missed a 12.45 mark, might as well just get there at one. I can stop and get some ice water. Is the best plan of action. The thing about stopping is the most convenient place between me and, oh, okay, and the nail salon is Dutch Bros. Nothing against Dutch Bros, but nothing against Dutch Bros. I love you, Dutch Bros. The gym I used to go to is up here. My most favorite gym. I live in Southern Oregon. Superior is the best gym. Ever. They have a women's only section and the gym itself layout is just like a lot of separate rooms. So even if there's people at the gym, it's not like you're all in one room and you have to like you can get some privacy, which like to me, women's only section and just like privacy is like what I really want to. Oh yeah, here's the Dutch Bros. And my nail salon is literally two minutes away. So if I stop here, get some ice water, there's a line. That's okay, hopefully it'll be quick. And then, oh, oh, yikes, there's a long line. I forget. That's the one with only one. Ugh, I'm not going to go. Maybe I'll go after. That's the one with only one side. So I thought there was a line, but there was like five cars on one side. I'm not getting out and walking up. just be thirsty actually I think my nail salon will give you gives you water maybe or they maybe have maybe they have one of those things with the water jugs that you like flip upside down okay this parking lot always stresses me out because there's people coming from all directions so here's the before of my nails absolutely horrible and I will give you the after once I'm done Okay, so I got my nails done. This is what they look like. Um, I don't hate them, but I also don't love them. I'll insert a picture of what I asked for. I'm usually like really specific with my French tip. I like the white part to be pretty skinny and then the base to be like an actual, like a pink color that's like darker than my nail. I don't like, you know, like cuticle lines, like your nail color kind of changes. I don't like that to show through. Um, but what he did was like use, use actual like white tips and then like just a clear acrylic. I don't know if you ever got your nails done, then you understand what I'm saying. 
Um, so yeah, I don't hate them. I just also don't love them, but I know I'll get used to them. I thought about the whole time. It honestly like went by pretty quick because the whole time I was like trying to think like, should I say something? Because as soon as he started doing it, I was like, oof. Um, so I was thinking when we got towards the end to just be like, can you just paint like all white over it? But I was like, you know what? It's not the end of the world. Um, so yeah, now I'm gonna get food really quick, hopefully really quick, and then head to Emily's house. Maybe I'll vlog with her kiddos if it's not too crazy, or maybe we'll want to walk or something. It's a really nice day, blue skies, shout out, no smoke. You can see as my, as a vlog goes on, my tanner is getting darker and darker <laughs> from when we started. I love it, I smell like waffles. My favorite scent ever is fake tan. It's like a very comforting scent to me, I don't know why, just because I do it all the time, but my first time doing it since like winter time, because I take a break for fall when I'm naturally tan, but it's been so smoky these past couple weeks that I'm getting pale. Okay, moving up. Talk later. Okay, this is like literally the worst lighting in the world. Um, went to Emily's house. I didn't um, end up vlogging there. She has three kids, so it's just like kind of crazy. Just didn't end up doing it. Did sell my computer, didn't get abducted. Met the girl, gave her the money. She asked a couple questions. And now I'm at the sporting event, so... We'll see what it's like. It's at high school. I said like a children's morning event, but he's like literally a senior in high school. So I don't really want to get made fun of by high school if I'm vlogging, but we'll see how Paige is feeling when I get in there. It's a soccer game though. I don't know anything about soccer, but I'm here to support. <laughs> okay, so we're at the sporting event. We got some snacks. Show me what you got. I got some chips. Um, two laughing Oh, don't, 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 don't just mind just flexing the Louis V. <laughs> And then I got popcorn, Dr. Pepper, ice cream sandwiches. What'd you guys get? A water and a blue laffy taffy. And a sports drink. And I got two ice cream sandwiches. Sports drink. Who's eating my other ice cream sandwich? Jake Kennedy? Yeah, Jake. Jake is eating it. Jake has zero words to say. He was all cool, calm, and collected until the camera came on. Are we winning or losing? We're winning. We're winning. We are Phoenix High School. We're winning by one. Caden Gallegos scored a goal. Gallegos. He and scored a goal. Assist. Yep. He also could use a headband. Uh, go Pirates. Arg. <laughs> okay, so it's the next day. I didn't end the vlog last night. I really have no excuse. I came home, watched Harry Potter, <laughs> finished my laundry, and just, you know, like Sunday night, even though technically it was a Monday night, but my Sunday night vibes, you just want to like chill out the absolute most um didn't eat dinner woke up absolutely starving but now it's tuesday i'm about ready to leave for work um i like my nails a little bit more um i kind of want to do a vlog this weekend we have two events so like an event on saturday and an event on sunday and not necessarily like not vlog the event i like would not <laughs> probably vlog at work. Um, but just like if I'm vlogging, vlogging that I'm talking about it and I, like so many people in my life ask me about my job and maybe you guys don't care at all, but I don't know, just like talk about, it's supposed to rain. So we're dealing with tents and just like kind of the process of how it all goes and how the week goes. We'll see. Hopefully I'm gonna edit this tonight and upload it on Wednesday or tonight, we'll see. Um, but yeah, let me know if you'd be interested in seeing vlog, more vlogs or kind of once again, like what you guys like seeing. But thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great week and I'll see you next time.